Yo guys, welcome back to Team Assassination. How's we doing today? And welcome to the fourth episode of Road to Legend Let's Play Mobile Legends. I can't believe it's already been the fourth episode. That means we'll be doing this for a month, okay? Because we do one episode per week. Oh wow, <clears throat> time passes fast. And sure enough, this episode, we are gonna feature Belmont and Clint, you know, because a lot of people have com been complaining Dave, do some tank, feed some tank, because a lot of people, are be, obviously we're doing a lot of carry, you know, like mages, like marksmen, for example, uh, assassins, like you're not doing any tank, you know, you're making a lot of people playing like all this kind of players, all the kind of ADC going mid right now. Well, first of all, I have to let you know, what I, the guy that I pro, uh, produce or guy that I introduce, that suits my play style. Most of the tips that you want to use, are tips that you use uh, how to engage in a team fight, your positioning on a team fight. But item build, for example, even item build, most of them are accurate, but sometimes I build different items because I need to carry the game. You know, obviously it's a solo carry all the way towards Glorious Legend. But if you are uh, new to the game and you want to play with some friends, you might play differently. Cause you play a support, like for example, last time Nana. You want to play Nana like a Nana, okay? So obviously this time I'm taking, I'm playing Belmont. And I take retribution again because I need to carry the game, like I said, right? So let's see how we'll do how we do this game. And uh, most likely, I'm gonna go mid, uh, and I want to get the jungle item, and I'll go for the tank jungle item level two. So let's see how we do here. Um, first, I'm gonna start off and by recommending this item here, scare gear item, and obviously, obviously, you know, you gotta throw. Uh, Zilong come in mid. So I want to clean this way really fast before Zilong show up here. Uh, okay. And obviously I want to ignore this fatty because I, I really don't want to deal with him. I want to go farm, you know. So what I want to do is go here, use Retribution, spin on this little minion here. And obviously Maya is here now to troll a little bit more. Um, I don't tell Maya to get the, get the fuck out of my lane, right? Obviously he didn't want to, so Maya's going bottom now. Leave top completely open. Um, which means they're gonna push away, right? But it's, it's okay. Um, we're gonna go top. I think Karina's going top now. I mean, this is a very interesting uh, team composition where where our team is going with this, you know? So, another trick with retribution is that you can use retribution, upgrade level 2, use retribution again, as you can see. Now I'm level 4, and I wanna set up a tank on, a, a tank on the top lane. Obviously, I already got top tower because no one's defending it. Uh, GG well played. But I'm coming, so let's see what we can do here. Karina going in, doing some damage. I'm gonna go in for it. We're going for Arath out here, right? We're going for Arath out here. Ult. And quickly spin again. Sure enough, gonna get a kill here, right after the kill. Um, this is Steve's one some too. I'm gonna slow him, you spin once again, and quickly get a double kill, right? <clears throat> Wherever easy, with the help of Karina, we can easily get a double kill here. And afterwards, what we do? We have a wave coming top, so let's just go ahead and push to the tower. And also, I do not want this minion to get close to our minion wave. So I'm going to go ahead and spin on this minion to make sure that we clean it. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and come over here. The one thing about Belmont is when you're spinning, you can't really use battle spells, which is quite interesting. Uh, I want to push to the tower, but this Arathel is being annoying right now. So we're going to go ahead and just do this and try to run away here. Uh, stop chasing me, Steve, please. Okay, so <clears throat> we still have to run away. And I want to come to mid lane actually because uh, obviously Fatty's, Fatty's over here. Hey Fatty! And I'm gonna come here and spin him, doing quite a bit of damage. He ulted me, but did zero damage. My ST just showed up, and Yun Zhao coming in with a flip, and sure enough, it's gonna be another kill for us. And afterwards, my team is gonna try to push mid a little bit. I'm gonna come here and take this take this little minion. Hopefully, it's long gonna take it. Yeah. You know, she tried to take it, but unfortunately for him, he's just not very smart. <laughs> so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. After us we're doing that, we have a Zilong coming in, chasing our team. Uh, we're gonna come here and spin the wave. Right afterwards, I see someone in the bush. Yeah, in fact, Arathel. Arathel uses ultimate jump away, and we're gonna ignore them actually on the mid lane because there's a quite, but a lot of fight going on over here. I want, I see an opportunity to go in for an ult and quickly get a kill here. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. But uh, yeah, seems like a pretty bad idea, after all. Um, use retribution here. Okay, and we got four. We got four charges on our on our uh, jungle item already, which gave us a lot of magic resist. So we're gonna spin this wave, try to kill this wave as fast as we can. As, uh, the jungle minion as fast as we can. Spin it, spin it, spin it, spin it. Let's see. Steez is half HP. I Meaning, like after killing this, we can kill him, right? We can try to kill him. So let's go. 
Um, all right, middle lane tower is gone now. Uh, just we're unfortunate. We're unfortunate. Spin this. Hasta la vista, baby. All right, there. All right, there we go. Got an easy kill. He seems to refuse to use his heal. Finally, he did. So it's kind of scared me because for the longest time he didn't use his heal, right? So we're gonna quickly get. Um, you see, use his heal again. Uh, give us a little bit of regen. I do not want to go in there because I can't kill them. So what I will, what I will do is actually come here and, you know, the one's gonna flip me, I think. However, I'm gonna get this minion. All right, Sloan. I'm wherever a tanky for you, unfortunately, at this point. You can't kill me, and I gotta kill you, right? So afterwards, I'm gonna come here and go to this. Because a couple more attacks, I'm actually gonna be killed by minions here, because I'm not tanky enough yet, right? There's some fight happening in the left lane, but I'm really low to go in there, so I decided not to. <laughs> and then, obviously, afterwards, I'm gonna come here and quickly farm again. It's all about economy, because we gotta carry the game, guys. We gotta carry the game as a tank, and then we're gonna build tank item, actually. We're actually gonna build tank item this game, you know, so to show our support for the team right here. So, uh, this is a long time to take the buff here, one more attack. We're gonna get it, and we're gonna wait here at this wall and charge over this wall and you spin to get this minion. Yeah, after you kill the minion, you got a lot of regeneration, and also because they're passive, you got a lot more HP back than other, other tank or other character would do in this game. So, afterwards, we're gonna finish up the first component of Curse Helmet. Because oh. oh Open Gangnam Star Gangnam Star Hey Franco Ah Franco active assault but on the, on the left side though with the Arathel still staying there Gonar on uh, Maya and has no idea that we're in the back so uh, we're gonna go ahead and punish her um Let's slow you. Yeah, so yeah. So, shut down. How many kills do you have? So, obviously, some fight going on on the, on the right side. We're gonna quickly come here. You wanna look at uh, getting habit of looking at the minimap all the time, okay? Now, I wanna use my charge. I wanna use my spin here, but I wanna make sure that I get to them first before I use my spin. So, after this, Layla is my prior target here. So, Layla's gonna die here. Yep, and you see is the next, right? Where does your steed go? You may wonder. So I don't know, but he's sure enough dead. I think all I need to do is come in here and use ultimate. I mean, sure enough, we're gonna get a kill. Arathel gonna stay in the front, trying to be a smart little lad. Uh, unfortunately, Arathel, I don't take any damage from you. Look at that. <laughs> oh, I don't, you don't do any damage to me, Arathel. Because Lone Hover, on the other hand, uh, have flip, you know, so I gotta be a little careful here. Karina got a kill, and, but in return, Karina, I'm dying. We're gonna go ahead and take some minion, right? Because I'm gonna ignore everything here. And uh, so we do have we do have this new item called Ancient Ghost Statue, which makes us running run so fast, right? As you can see right now, I'm gonna kill this. And you can see my movement speed right now at 310. And when I get out of combat, it's gonna increase by 30, which is gonna go to 340. So just give me one second, let me kill this thing. And I'm gonna start running. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, three hundred seventy. Actually, increased by sixty movement speed, which is freaking insane. Cause rapid boost only gave you fifty movement speed. This is a lot of movement speed. Let's see, Steve's on the top lane. The RSL and Layla. So I'm gonna quickly just do this. Ah, uh, Franco, we're gonna use all. I'm gonna try to get away here at this point. So. <laughs> Uh, 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 I see Steve's here using ultimate. There's no, nothing they can do here. Uh, I do have these Steve's all on me, so. Ugh! He's all on top of it. Get a lot of kill. Oh, I got hooked! But don't worry, I got these Steve's killed right next to me, and I got. Uh, oh, oh, they do have um, some damage on top of me, so I gotta be a little careful here, but it's okay though. I'm very tanky, like I said, I'm not afraid of them. So I'm just gonna charge away. Let's actually charge to a different direction here. Um, but it's okay. And I think my setting is actually wrong. I want to use close to the target setting to be honest, because this way I can use um, the attribution on the person I closest to me, which usually is Franco. So afterwards, I want to get this blade armor because they do have uh, quite a bit of 80 damage. And you can see my build right now. 
Uh, because early early on, when you're in your lower elo, like Master or, and below, you will see a lot of people like to play a lot of Marksman, right? So you want to get Blade Armor. You want to get Blade Armor. This way you can reflect damage and be very, very tanky. Okay, be very, very tanky. So afterwards, we're going to go to mid lane and see, take a look at the map here. I mean, some people are low. I got ultimate, so let's come in here. Okay. And quickly come here. Layla, 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 don't be cute now. Alright, time to run away. Be Arathel, there, there it is, there you are. Arathel. Ah, you so much damage. Okay, okay, Steve's acting me heal. All right, let's go, Franco. Let's go. You want you want to do something? Let's go. Oh my God, Franco chased me all through the map and died. Good job, Franco. Steve's coming just in time. You know, finally after uh, the three-hour chase, we got some help from our teammates. Now I'm doing some moonwalk action, which is okay. And um, so I see Zilong actually going on his steeds. I'm going in and using spin right here. Look how much damage Luda do just from my spin. Even though I'm not, uh, I'm not a damage dealer. I'm a tank, you know. But it's okay though. So let's go ahead and spin on this minion. I'm gonna use my retribution in the end just to secure this buff right here because I'm carrying again. Oh my god! I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened, but it's okay though. Uh, sometimes, um, you know, li life is like a box of chocolate. You never know what you're gonna get. You never know what you're gonna get, okay? So, it's these activating heal once again. I'll give us a lot of HP back, but not quite enough. You know, not quite enough. I'm gonna come here and spin this little two minions right here. Um, and after, every time you kill something with Bellman's passive, you get 10%, uh, 4% percent kill after killing a minion. Let's go, baby. Let's go. You want to fight a buff? Let's go. Let's see who can fight a buff. Obviously, you don't actually do that. All right, you don't actually do that. Now, um, I have these steez. You think I'm afraid of you? You think I'm afraid of you? <laughs> Where is he healing at? I'm looking for the heal. <laughs> That feels good. Oh, that feels really good. That feels so good. Oh, that feels awesome, guys. <laughs> but be a barbarian, right? Do what barbarian do. When you're playing barbarian, you want to put yourself in his shoes. What would a barbarian say when he's about to kill someone? You know, and that's exactly what he would say. Let's go sell our jungle item. We're we're already you know at level 15, uh, close to 15. So not sure of being mortality. So make sure that we can survive. And right after that, we're gonna go ahead and hit this nexus. Hit the base crystal right here, right? Make sure we win. You know, ignore them, ignore them. And there we go. GG well played. So basically, you can see when you play Belmont, go full tank, okay? You can still do a lot of damage. At the same time, you won't be able to die, okay? So it's a fun game, guys. And with that, we're gonna progress to Master 4. And let me know what do you guys think about the Belmont gameplay, right? We got 11 0 11. Uh, in China, it actually stands for, you know, being, being single for life. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. MVP here, let's look at total damage. Damage chart, we actually did the most amount of damage. More than Maya, more than Yunjia Zilong, more than Karina, and we did a, not so much tower damage though, but it's okay, we tanked the most amount of damage. So GG well played once again, and with that guys, let's move on to our second game. Yo guys, while we're waiting for our second game, I do want to talk about something which is claiming your rewards, okay? So every now and then, every time you update your game and all that kind of stuff, you can you can go to your inbox e e on the right top side and click on claim all. And you get a lot of good stuff. As you can see, I haven't claimed for a while because I want to show you guys what to do. And I'm able to claim quite a bit, right? Quite a bit. So afterwards, we're going to go ahead and go to achievements and make sure that we get all the achievements that we got already. So let's see if we're able to upgrade to a new level here. Uh, that's my account, we can level 19. If we can just get to 1,000 or 960 more achievement points, we can get to level 20. So how do we do that? Why don't we take a look? 
All right, we'll take a look in our next episode. <laughs> Since we got a game here, um, if, we, if this game doesn't load, obviously, we're gonna take a look. But let's all hope this game loads so we can go ahead and play Clint. One of my all-time favorite champion. This hero, um, so much carry potential, so much, so strong. Especially in lower elo, if you play the, if you can, if you like to play marksman, this is marksman to go. Obviously, uh, there are a lot of other marksmen right now that are really, really good. For example, I always like um, the mechanic of Moscow. I like Irithel a lot. Irithel is so much more fun. If you have the money to purchase her, get Irithel. Okay, now, but obviously, I'm gonna play Clint, right? Because Clint is cheap. I bought it. I think our first episode I talked about, it, I got it for free. You know, not for free, but really cheap. I think 6,000 BP points. Uh, claim you to go for 15,000, and I just got it, right? So I'm gonna use jungle emblem sets and use retribution once again, just to make sure that I can farm a little faster. And let's go ahead, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna go mid lane. I have to do two marksmen, but that's okay though. And with your battle spell, I take retribution just to farm. If you're not confident, take something else, right? Take sprint. Um, that's a really good battle spell that I recommend um, in a lower elo. Uh, but why is it, when you first begin, take retribution on Clint. Take retribution. It'll help you farm a lot faster. You just have to position better. But in a lower elo, people don't really focus that much, so you can easily position most likely most of the time, right? Uh, considering the other team don't have a Smurf. In general, the item wise, I'm gonna get uh, jungle item off first, and then I'll get Berserker Fury as first item just to boost out my damage, and then I'll get Rapid Boots and go to. Thunderbelts. And just so you know, uh, 80 marksmen right now in a higher elo are not getting picked that much because it takes so long to farm. And it's, it, right now with the mage meta, there's so many good champions that you can actually pick that are much better. So um, obviously we're not um, in, in lower elo though, marksman's the best way to carry. You can take down tower, you can take down turtle, you can take on different kind of objectives really, really fast. So. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and do that. We're gonna go ahead and do that and show you how to play Clem properly. Look at the, look on the other side. We do have Layla, Harley, La Pula, with Zilong, and Chow. You know, uh, really strong crawl control and damaging bursty com uh, com team comp on the other side. Look at our comp. It's absolutely it's interesting. You know, we got a panda. You know, Akai is really good by the way. Don't take this wrong, but not as strong as Cho and La Pula Pula. You know, so I'm gonna go ahead and say. Zilong, by the way, that's Chinese. And Zilong, top. Okay, obviously he doesn't want to, so when he doesn't want to, there's nothing we can do about it. We'll just go ahead and try to make last hit as, as, fa as much as we can, right? There we go. After getting last hit, we're gonna get a jungle item, and we're gonna get it to level two. To make to help our farm, help our farm, right? We're gonna use retribution here. Zilong's going for the buff side, so we're gonna take this down really, really quickly and go to the buff side. And hopefully we get it, hopefully we get it. I'm not sure because obviously we have a troll here, uh, but it's okay. Um, it's just what it's just what you expect, right? I mean, it's, it's what you really, what you really get, right? This this look. Oh, we got it, we got it. It's Karina. Try to steal a second buff there for you. You know, we're, we're interesting choice. You already have a buff, my friend. Why try to get another one? You know, we're, we're interesting position there, but it's okay. Um, one more last hit. Sure enough, I'm gonna get it. And after you get Retribution, don't just use it yet. What you want to do is come to... You can, I have enough money for jungle item level 2 right now, but I'm not going to use it. So I'm going to dash out, use one attack, use Retribution, pure, uh, use jungle, upgrade my jungle item, use it again. As you can see, I, when, once I upgrade my jungle item from level two level, level 1 to level 2, I do refresh my Retribution. After resistance fight happening on the bottom lane, we're going to quickly come over here and and quickly got it, got it first blood right here, right? So... Unfortunately, I can't chase anymore, and I was hoping for a lucky crit there, but that didn't happen. So, <laughs> oh, didn't get a kill, but it's all good. Afterwards, we're gonna get a boot. Um, just, just get boots, just because they don't have party. You do want to position. You do want to position a little bit better, and with sure enough, we're able to get that right. And the Harley is pushing mid. We're gonna go ahead and use her pushing kill the jungle monster really fast, and come back to mid lane. At this point, I'm close to level five, and I think Harley just turned level four. If I didn't, yeah, he. Actually, he's close to level 5 already as well. So, 2 to 1 right now, our um, Karina didn't die, but it's okay. Your early game is just purely farm. It's gonna be boring, but in order to carry the game, you, that's basically what you have to do, okay? 
And I'm also gonna buy a magic necklace because uh, Marksman does lack a lot of mana and buff doesn't give you mana unless you kill the small monster uh, with a level 2 jungle item. As you can see right now, after, every time I kill something, I do get a little bit, a little bit of mana back. And, and obviously Karina doesn't come top because he doesn't know how to look at the minimap. I already cleaned the top wave, so what he's supposed to do is actually go mid. Um, now he missed the entire minion wave on the mid lane. And we're gonna come here. I'm not gonna use my movement abilities yet because they do have a hardy once again. So I want to be a little bit careful with my positioning. And I'm not, I'm not out, out attacking the the hardy just here. He uses ultimate uh, for no reason, as you can see. He uses ultimate, didn't send any damage to follow up the uh, the ultimate, which means the ultimate is gonna do no damage, which is quite you know <laughs> interesting. But it's okay though. Yeah, people do whatever they want, right, to make them happy. So. <laughs> Uh, we're gonna kill this small monster here. Use one more ult and one ult attack. Sure enough, we're gonna get another kill. And a lot of fight going on over here. A lot of fight going on. Is Karina dead? Most likely, yeah. And again, I don't do I don't do close to enough damage to make this worth it. So, oh, he filled his dash, but still, again, I don't have enough damage to kill this Harley right now. So I'm just not going to. You know, I'm just gonna focus on my farm and heal like I farm enough, right? So. One more attack, there we go. Harley tried to use his ability, I mean, unfortunately for you, Harley, you need to watch our Harley guide to know how to play Harley properly. <laughs> so after killing this uh, jungle minion, we're gonna come to the wrap off here. Okay, it's all about the economy, guys. Look at a farm right now. I'm level seven with 2,600 gold, compared to Harley with 2,000 gold, the most farming champion on, our t on their side. And you just don't wanna do that. You, you wanna make sure you maintain a really, really high standard of farm, so this way you can be really far ahead. And especially with Marksman, if you don't get farmed late game, you'll be completely, completely, completely useless to your team, okay? So after Harley uses the first ability here, I want to actually go away to the, to the bottom lane here. Noticing that no, nothing on the bottom jungle, and Karina is completely FK standing in that little bush. I don't really know what she's doing right now, but, you know, who cares? So, so we're going to throw an ability to uh, use proc our passive to clean the way faster. Harley going to take this little, 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 little cannon minion here. I'm gonna ignore Harley, obviously, uh, because it didn't really help us to do anything to him. We can't kill him, and he could have killed me pretty easily. So after after successful kill me away, we're gonna come here and take this jungle minion, and obviously walk towards top lane because top lane have some fight going on. And the pull up, pull up, retreating. Same as Chow. Um, there have a lot of people here. It's like a party here. Ah. Not able to do enough damage, right? But obviously in the late game, I could have killed a child pretty easily. Unfortunately right now, as you can see right now, this game is already in a really bad, uh, looks in really bad for our team. Um, and that's gonna be a hard game for us. And this is the game worth playing, worth playing a little bit, you know? Because it will show you how to play Clint and solo carry your team. Obviously right afterwards, we're gonna come back to mid lane. Notice thing that enemy enemy Zalong's right here. We're gonna use our, use our abilities to proc some damage on these Zalong. Make sure that he's low enough that he does not want to jump on us, right? As you can see, that this is the Berserker Fury paying off right now, you know? All right, we're gonna throw a first ability onto this Zalong. Obviously, it's not. It's high noon. No idea um, how much damage we're gonna do. And obviously, when he's standing onto my, when he is standing on the first ability, my my smoke cloud, he's gonna miss most of his all attack, you know? As, that's your skill description, by the way, if you don't know. So I'm gonna go ahead, oh, Chell's right here, look at that. I'm gonna quickly diagro this minion right here just because Cho is here. So. Ah. We got it, we got it, no problem. Now, Harley's here, we're gonna quickly dash away there. They don't wanna take any more damage from Harley. Um, and obviously, Carry come, same as Panda. They jumped in, and Harley now is gonna die right here. Carry ended Harley, and Cho come in. Um, obviously, we're, we're interesting. I'm gonna use my retribution to slow the child. One more auto attack. In fact, we're sure enough gonna get a kill on the child. And child actually have flicker, so quite interesting how those people have flicker and still playing really, really interesting. You know, um, it means you're quite a bit high level already. As long as on the other on the other side, we're gonna take the first first part of our um, thunder belt. This way, we can kite better, especially with rapid boots. No one can catch us. Okay, even Zlong, he can catch us, but he will die. You know, because we're so old. We're so over farmed compared to the one actually at this point. If you look, look, my auto attack already crit 900 damage. And hopefully this, let's get him to take it. All right. Lalela is only level eight. I'm already level 11, you know? We're gonna quickly clean, obviously this guy has no idea what's happening right now. Um, so long as I'm on the side, I do not want to get in a position where I'm tanking damage. So I'm not going to. Okay, so so long actually jump in, flicker, use my auto attack to assist. Panda's gonna die here, or I mean actually died. 
So quite unfortunate. We're gonna try to get away at this point because Cho is chasing me. He does not have flicker. So we, we can be a little, you know, aggressive with my auto attack. Just walk and auto attack, walk and auto attack, dash. And sure enough, sure enough, we almost got a kill on Chow. Chow is hiding in this bush right here, so I don't want to jump in. Because if I go in there, Chow is going to use his kick on me directly, you know? So let's go ahead. There we go. He finally kicked. Oh, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. Okay. Okay, you're dead. See ya. See ya, Chow. Obviously, Chow thinks that he can auto attack me. I use my retribution on him to do some true damage. And at the same time, he has no idea how much damage I'm able to do, right? Um, even though Chow is the ADC convert, but unfortunately for you, I out farm and I'll scale you every single way, right? So afterwards, we're gonna go ahead and go home. Um, because we're out of everything. A mana, HP, you name it, we don't have it. <laughs> so uh, we're gonna go ahead <laughs> and go back to our go back to our buff here and take our buff, right? Make sure that we keep on getting those. Because again, I'm carrying the game where it's hard right now. So I have to make sure that I'm, I'm maintaining my standard of farm right here. You know, after successful taking it, our all attack, our passive right now can help us proc 1,200 damage already, and it's only eight minutes into the game. Okay, but again, ADC compare if you equal amount of farm on a saber, for example, I can kill Clint pretty easily, right? So that's why that's why in a higher elo game, Clint's no longer picked. Because I mean, ADC no longer picked because. They take so long to farm, and people don't like that, you know? Uh, we're gonna sell this. After we oh, finally get Thunder Belt, this, right now, we're actually really, really, really done strong, you know? And we'll try to do something to this Harley right here. Um, actually, they have a Layla showing up. I would have tried to kill this Harley, but Layla showed up, uh, which kind of made me scared a little bit. So, we're actually not gonna do that, and I'm just gonna quickly clean this wave right here. This zone's going on our zone right now. We're gonna go ahead and use our ability. Unfortunately, the Zalong is dead. And nowhere for you to go, my friend. Look at look at Thunderbell slow, right? And this is exactly what I'm going for. You know, this is exactly what I'm going for. I'm gonna slow him to the ground. He's not able to move at all. So look at the damage right now. I'm able to clean wave super fast. And afterwards, we're gonna go for Wind Talker. You know, Wind Talker give you movement speed and give you a lot of crit, which is exactly what you need. Uh, oh, look at this guy. I, I couldn't dodge that, unfortunately. Uh, crap. Oh, you came back in, huh? They came back in. Interesting enough. Very, very interesting. So don't go in for a flip. One more auto attack, sure enough. We're gonna get a kill. Layla here wants something, too. And this Zalong have no, no slow limit. Come in here, try to challenge the almighty Clint. And Cho on the other side, we're gonna go ahead and use Retribution to slow him. He does have a kick, and he's on the other side. So, um, I'm actually lagging a little bit, but it's okay. Uh, it's the, the phone is getting hot. Every time you run a really, really high resolution game on, on your phone, it just happened to be that way. The quick way to solve it is make sure that you have your phone um, fully charged and make the resolution a little, uh, little bit lower, right? Turn the resolution a little bit lower. That's not what I want to do though. Uh, so, because <laughs> I lost my resolution. So I come over here and quickly clean the wave once again with Retribution. 1700 true damage with Retribution. Freaking insane. Okay. So I think quickly we're going to get our Wind Chalker. So let's just go ahead and follow this Lapu Lapu here. Lapu Lapu in the bush taking his buff. And. Alright, your buff's mine now, right? See, because because we're able to do so much damage on him, we scared the hack out of Slop Lopo, right? Now, Panda's not going in right now, which, you know, if Frontline's not going in, you're not going in. Okay, oh, this, this guy's dead. This guy's dead. Unfortunately, Layla followed up, followed up the ultimate on top of Hardy's ult. So, <laughs> quite unfortunate for him. At the same time, uh, again, our team just feeding, right? Like, over and over and over and over. So long as not pushing towers either. It's just we're we're a tough game, but we got this. We got this. Um, okay. So our next item is actually going to be. I want to get endless battle to be honest, but at the same time it doesn't stack anymore. So I think the fallen sword is a much better choice. Okay. It gives you life steal. Um, okay. I can flip me. It's fine. My first ability. Oh god. Oh, I'm so dead here. Unfortunately, Harley showed up. So, I was gonna solo Zalong pretty easily, but Harley showed up, which just 
whole different ball game, you know, for Dave. So <laughs> Dave died, but it's okay though. Uh, we're gonna come back, you know. At this point, I really need a team because I cannot solo push against the Lom and the Harley, you know, because obviously they're not pushing because they're noobs. At the same time, like I try to push, but they're defending, and our team pretty are all just farming right now. They're not doing anything productive, which makes this game a whole lot, whole lot harder. And right now, look at Karina. Karina has no idea what she's doing, and he might just die right here. Um, Lapu who can throw one ability and actually missed completely and end up dying there. At the same time, look at our team, right? Panda, Carry, Zalong, all died. And they're typing language I don't understand now. Uh, I don't know if it's a language or a symbol. I don't know what it is, you know. On the bottom lane though, this guy is half HP, let's go. Oh, can't get to him. So we're gonna take the first component of Fallen Sword, let's go. Uh, Oh my god. Crazy regeneration. Can we can I survive? Alright, good. Apparently only Layla's ult was, was able to hit me. There's no other follow-up damage. So end up surviving. Um, again, I, I don't know what I actually don't know what to do at this point because my team is absolutely garbage. And let's use retribution on this Layla. Layla, sure enough, you can die right now. Right? Obviously Layla, uh, thinking that you can just stay there and all attack. Unfortunately, you meet your match. You meet your match. Okay. So we're gonna have to go ahead and kill this. Um, take this wave right now. Take this buff right now. Um, obviously, Carrie took it because Carrie need the buff so much more than me. You can look at his carry score. Right, best score in the world right now. All right, look at carry score two five and two. Oh, of course, he knows what he's doing. You know. So, by the way, if you don't understand, I say that ironically. Ironically, I actually don't know what he's doing. So come here. Come here. I take the Lord here, right? Let's see, let's see what's in the taxi gonna if our team's gonna follow up. All right, finally they all came, which is really good for us because in a lower elo game, if you were to get a Lord, it's really really good. Okay, Lord is actually doing a lot of damage right now with the new updated Lord. So let's go ahead and just kill this minion over and over and over again. I'm level 15 right now, and that means I no longer need this item. I can now sell it for Blade of Despair. In fact, Panda may die here once again just because. Uh, I was gonna help, but I'm gonna take the opportunity to push bottom. We're gonna push on bottom, coming in, uh, coming in fast. Let's go ahead and let's hope that we can split push and end the game right here. Let's see if we can do that successfully. We got a lot of pushing in here. They do. They, they are gonna break our mid tower though, unfortunately. So let's see who push faster over here. Uh, unfortunately, we can't we can't take it. And mid lane though, can they kill anyone? Can they kill anyone? They cannot. So we we'll have to go home really quickly, defend our base. Otherwise, our base is gone. We have a Lord pushing us. Hope. Oh Lord. Oh Zlong. Zlong actually. Oh my God. Oh my God. One person. One hero who saved the world. Uh, I, I should have just stayed bottom and you know go with the Lord actually. That was a uh, uncalculated move. You know I did not expect Zlong to be a boss in the world in there. To be honest with you, so this is actually quite unexpected, but it's okay though. Uh, with the super empowered minion, we're gonna go ahead and take this, take the tower right here. Lord gonna continue to push in. Finally, Lord dies, but we we successfully achieve and get their bottom inhibitor the tower, which is really good for us. But at this point of the game, uh, losing mid inhibitor tower is actually really bad. And let's see if if we can get the top tower here quickly, 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 quickly. Just ignore everything and go for the tower. Just ignore everything and go for the freaking tower. That's what you want. Okay, one more auto attack. Just to scare you a little bit. That's all. I don't want anything else. No harm. No harm taken. No harm taken. No harm taken. Okay. Take it, take it, take it. Make sure this guy doesn't take it away from me, right? Especially this Karina. Because, uh, again, I need to carry the games right now, my friend. You don't want to take that away from me. Do you? You know? At the same time, at our team, the enemy team is pushing mid and then... We do not have our mid open, so it's quite dangerous. I'm gonna go ahead and try to harass this Zalong right here. Zalong, I don't think he even noticed that we're here. All right, Cho actually flickered for some reason. We're gonna go ahead and slow him. Layla's on the side. Panda, um, let's go ahead and make sure I'm untagging Layla. Uh, La Pula Pula, pretty old me. Unfortunately, I got, look at the kiting right now. Look at how much damage I'm able to do. Oh, oh! At the same time, okay. Oh god, I'm able to dash away from that. Oh my god, that was actually so close. 
Oh, because we're able to successfully dodge that ultimate from um, Harley by hiding behind <laughs> our teammate right here. And this is going to be in the game, actually, with all of them dying. Uh, Harley is Harley's actually back home successfully, so this actually posed some challenge for us. We're going to go ahead and push the wave here and see what we can do. Um, all right, Harley tried to run away at this point. Mm, good choice, good choice. Which is a pushing away right here. Reports alone from enemy side, but I don't. I can give a flying whip. I just want to end this game, right? Uh, doesn't matter what you say. How mad? It, how mad you are about your teammate? Look at a crit. Look at a crit right now. Two shot and two shot indeed. This guy hardly died, right? This guy just died. So we're gonna go ahead and keep on doing damage. Oh my god, this lag is actually crazy right now. I'm not sure what's happening, but. Uh, let's use regeneration right here. I'm having quite a bit of lag, as you can see. Uh, but it's okay though. I'm low on everything. At this point, I could have choose to go home. Actually, let's just let's just take this buffer. Let's take buff away from them. Make sure they don't have the buff, right? And then we're gonna go home afterwards. So we have everything we need except for. Let's see, at this point you can buy tank potion or you can buy this potion, power potion, which give you 30 points of physical attack, 5% physical life steal, last 120 seconds. Mm, it sounds pretty good, but is it as good as is useful? I use buy tank potion in high elo because I always get put myself in a very dangerous positioning. And here, we're gonna go ahead and take down this Lord. Lord, actually, it doesn't matter if you hit it or not, you have to take a lot of damage just because. And Karina's AFK, as you can see. Fallen Sword right now is giving us a lot of life steal. Oh my god. Alright, you can go. See your, see your. Ah, uh, I'm so dead. But we do get the Lord, I believe. Or I don't think we did. But Sloan went in. Sloan is gonna die right here. We do have three way of minion going in. Uh, let's see if mid midway minion can do something. They do not have any minion wave. Lord is going in. All right, this is really, really good for us at this point. Um, even though we all die, but they, they don't have a way. Because they don't have a way, they can't end the game. Layla is trying to pass the minion. Try to just go for the base right here. Unfortunately for you, Layla, uh, he's going. He's attacking the base outside the base range because of Layla. And my my resurrection has six seconds on it. At the same time, we got a uh, Lord coming back. <laughs> Lord is coming back. <laughs> oh, nice, nice, nice. Now we got a wave coming in, they cannot push this anymore. Layla tried to push the, uh, the wave, unfortunately. Um, f luckily for us, Karina ended up showing up just in time, and Panda showed up. They have enough on their timer so to respond at the same time. Oh, that was a close one. That was a really close one. Layla, because it's a unique, unique passive where she's able to get a tech range when she levels up, it's really, it's actually quite scary. Actually quite scary, especially in the setting where your team is not peeling for you. So I'm gonna just try to go for the Layla first, you know. The Layla is the only target I need to kill. kill. But right, really what I want to do is pushing a tower. I need to end the game right now. I need to end the game right now. So when my sneak behind the enemy back, enemy line, you know, Chow is actually going on me. So they are actually pretty organized, to be honest, you know. Compared, not compared to our team here. Let's go ahead and just clean this wave right here. And we're gonna go ahead and just stay bottom. You know, stay bottom. Let's see what they do. See what they do. Are they gonna come for us? Are they not? They are top. Let's take the opportunity to push bottom, guys. We see two people top, which may attract. Zalone's going top. Also, Hardy's on top lane. Where's Layla? I wanna see where Layla is. I wanna see where Zalone is before I continue forward. Um, actually, actually, gonna buy us some more time. All right, because of this, I see more people, more people going top lane now. This is our opportunity, guys. We're gonna steal base. It's gonna be successful. We're gonna go ahead and jump. Jump, 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 one more auto attack! No yes! One has ever done GG that. well played, no right? Ever you still tower like that in the history it's of really difficult. I do not want to drag the game any longer. Uh, <laughs> solo carry with ADC. You have to make sure that you're getting those you're hitting those towers, okay? So with that we're gonna get two stars. We're gonna get master two, two master two with two stars now. We're gonna progress. Woo, to the next rank. Rank up once again, guys. GG well played. And for an easy MVP. Not easy MVP, hard MVP, guys. Really hard victory because, like, you're playing marksman. No one's peeling for you on your team. I mean, like, no one's protecting you. It's just really, really difficult. But we got it. We able to, like, you know, keep on keeping on. You know, go through the hard game. Look at our team scores. 0-5, 5-7, 6-7, 8-7. Look at total damage. 
I did 60% of the tower damage, and I did 38% of the hero damage. I mean, that's just absurd, absurd amount of damage, you know, that I did all by myself as a marksman. So, uh, quite unfortunate for, uh, as a game for the, for the teammates here, because, you know, everybody's new. But it's okay, though. GG well played. And guys, let me know. What do you, what you guys want to see in the next episode? Leave a comment down below in the comment section on what champion you'd like to see. But as, as higher, when we climb, uh, to higher, a higher elo actually, it's gonna be harder. It's gonna be a lot harder, okay? For you to gain stars. I mean like, so you, you, I don't wanna play, for example, Monkey King, because it's not gonna work, right? To help you rank up. It's one of the worstest champions in the game right now. They're actually doing a lot of work and then to rework the Monkey King. The, the rework should come up soon. I'm not sure when, but don't request those kind of gameplays. First of all, it's very expensive. Second of, second of all, you can never carry with Monkey King, all right? So with that, guys, hit like and subscribe. Join Team Assassination, hit the love, and Assassin Dave signing off. See you guys next time, bye now.